hey, in this third video, I'm going to talk about applying for a trademark. So if you've done steps one and two properly, all you really have to do is use that information, enter that information into uh, the website. So make sure you've got your name, uh, whether you're an individual or a corporation, make sure you've got your address, your phone number, your email, um, the name or logo that you want to do, for example, um, and your dates of first use. Um, make sure you have your specimens if you're doing an actual use application, meaning you're in business right here. Make sure you know the difference between uh, date of first use uh, anywhere and date of use in commerce. Okay, and then uh, enter in the rest of the information. Usually, it's the applicant, um, a contact. If, if there's a contact information, uh, and then um, and then submit it and pay the filing fee. Now, this step is usually pretty straightforward if you've done number one and two um, properly. Uh, all you have to do is really just enter that information into the trademark office uh, system. Make sure you have a my.uspto.gov um, uh, account so you can apply for your trademark. So this is step three in this five-step video series on how to apply for your trademark.